Hey y'all, welcome back to Adventuring with Amanda. Thank you so much for being here. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Y'all, I'm feeling good today. I'm feeling good for the first time in a while because as you guys know, I've been on the struggle bus, but I just took a break from YouTube for almost a week, which is something I have not done since December, 2020. And I needed it. Like normally if I take like two days off from making a video, I'm like, I can't do it. Like I have anxiety because I love putting up YouTube videos so much, but I've been feeling so defeated by life itself that I just needed a break. So I took this past week, you know, I had this, um, tire fiasco again, another tire issue. Um, but I got to spend time with my mom this weekend and my brother and his girlfriend and just being like with my loved ones and going to baseball games and taking a break from making content was very helpful. Very helpful. So Winston's feeling amazing. I'm feeling good. So I have a life at camp video for you guys. And I also want to remind you that I have my adventuring with amanda stickers for sale i've gotten a lot of orders already so thank you so much um i have the the circular uh adventuring with amanda stickers and then the square one so these i'm selling in a pack so if you buy both of these it's seven dollars but if you spend ten dollars then you also get the four sheet stickers so the sheet stickers are the small adventuring with Amanda, the small black and white adventuring with Amanda. I can't, I'm doing van things. And van life is life. So I have three sticker bundles. So either $7 for the two big main stickers which they have like a really cool kind of like metallic finish to them almost. Like these are so dope. So $7 or you can just buy the four sheet stickers for $5 or you can buy them all for 10 So that's the best value. And honestly, that's been the um, most popular sticker bundle so far is the $10 bundle. So you get six, six stickers. And I am fulfilling them in my van this week while I'm camping. So get your orders in. And I'll get it sent out to you this week. So that is it for the housekeeping stuff. Let's dive into the video. All right, so it is very muddy. So what I'm doing to try and get to my friends is uh, driving on the, like driving outside of the roads because it is so, so, so muddy. I kind of slipped getting in here. So, driving on the gravel next to the roads in an attempt to make it safely. <laughs> Which is fine, all this gets, before anyone comes at me, all this gets driven by rigs and trailers and stuff anyways, so. Oh yeah, look at how muddy this is. Try and go next to it. Whoop, whoop. All right, so far so good. Well, we made it. What's nice about my van setup and also staying very limber and <laughs> mobile physically is that I don't have to get out of my van. I was just able to climb over the console. And uh, yeah, so we can just kind of hang out in here until the rain subsides, but we made it safely just by driving next to the dirt road that was insanely muddy. I just wanted to get here. I was very anxious. I've been in, been in a house for too many nights. There's Tim, Stacy, and Tracy. And Todd. Back with my homies. And I think I'm level, so I'll just park here for now. I'm not going to take anything out of the van. 
Got some nice muddy tires, but that's okay. It'll dry up and come off in no time. Winston is feeling amazing. His ear looks really, really good. He gets antsy just like I do when we're in the house. You know, we've been home for a week, spent time with my mom, but gosh, we just, we have a hard time being cooped up in, in a house and being in the city, so. Nature is healing for both of us and especially because I went to so many baseball games this last week. I was just so over city life and civilization. Happy to be out here after today, which actually I don't really mind this weather for a day, but tomorrow it's supposed to be gorgeous and sunny and clear. We'll have awesome weather this week. Oh my. Oh my. You know what's interesting? Is that you really only do that when we're camping. You don't do it at the house. Isn't that funny? I know. Isn't that weird? Yeah, you're silly about it. Do you know Hazel's over there? You know Hazel's across the street? You'll get to see her tomorrow when it's sunny. I know. Y'all, I took 12 minutes of awesome footage this morning of me setting up my camp and I had my Bluetooth mic on. I thought that everything was fine because it's been working. Yeah, would you believe I'm having another issue with a second Bluetooth mic that is completely different. Went back to watch the video and it was like all messed up. So I'm having to voice over this portion, which I'm bummed about because I wanted to show you this portion in real time as I spoke. So as you can see, it looks like I'm talking to myself. No, I was actually talking into my Bluetooth mic. Didn't work out so well. But this morning I put up my awning because it's actually supposed to be 86 degrees on Thursday. It'll be an abnormally hot day and then it'll cool back down. So I wanted to get my awning up and place everything around it appropriately. I put my awning up and do my complete camp setup if I'm going to be somewhere at least four days and I know that I'm safe because I don't attach my awning if I'm worried about some situation because it's attached to my van. So I'm just getting all of the things set up right now. I already plugged in my solar. I had to put up my water table, Winston's playpen, and I'm doing this all early in the day so I can enjoy my day and I don't have to set up. But I'm happy with everything. It is peaceful around here and I'm finally feeling relaxed, ready to spend some time with everybody and keep Winston safe. All right, I have lost 18 pounds since January 1st. 20 was my goal, but I might go for 25 right now because I'm feeling great and it's been amazing, an amazing lifestyle change. So I intermittent fast from 12 to 5 and I eat one high protein meal a day. So I um, am making a cheeseburger patty with pepper jack cheese and then I will put onions and bacon on it. I made a couple extra pieces of bacon for me and Winston to share. And then I also have some like Greek veggie salad. So that'll be my snack for today. But it's worked really well. I mean, I'm down 18 pounds. Got my pepper jack. Give that a little chance to melt here. And then I'm going to put onions, bacon, and then put another slice of the pepper jack cheese. I just, I turned it down to low um, because my burger is essentially cooked. Just want to get that, give that cheese a chance to warm up. If I had a lid, I could put that over it right now, but um, so I'll do that. 
the bacon, another slice of cheese, and then that will be my main protein for lunch. I compromised since I don't have a lid to help the cheese melt, so I just put some foil on it. <laughs> and it's working, so yay van life things. What a truly glorious day. It's been such a good one. I've gotten so much done. I feel well fed from lunch. Tracy and Todd both went into town, but I went to catch up with Stacy and Tim, which was awesome. It's very quiet. It's very peaceful. Winston's sleeping. And all I have going on the rest of the day is to listen to my baseball game later. So with that being said, I will wrap it up. Thank you guys so much for watching, for hanging in there during my break. Remember to like and subscribe. I will see you next time.